Hello everyone, Chastek Reviews back and today's video is about how to fix how files get deleted automatically when I click the, the monitor or open when some files on the computer, the computer deletes the file automatically. So on this video, we are going to see five solutions to solve this problem. So let's start from solution number one. And all the solutions will work for all Windows operating system, Windows 11, Windows 10, and other. So the first solution would be if your computer is automatically deleting files, maybe this thing is related with virus. So to solve this problem, you can use your uh, built-in Windows security antivirus, or you can download a third party antivirus. Let's check by uh, built-in antivirus, which is the Windows security. So click here, the search icon and type here Windows security. So here the window security, select the window security. And after that, click on here, virus and threat protection. And click here, scan options. And after that, it will give you different options, a quick scan, a full scan, custom scan, and Microsoft Defender online scan. Select the full scan and scan now this option. And it may take uh, some time based on the files that are on your computer. If you have a large number of files, it may take a larger time. And if you have small amount of file, it may take small uh, time. So scan your computer for virus, or you can use a third, uh, a third party antivirus like malware bytes or other antiviruses to scan your computer. So if scanning your computer from virus, is not helping you then the second solution is updating your mouse driver so in order to update your mouse driver click here the search icon and type here device manager so select here the device manager then after that go here and find here mice and other pointing option click here the arrow and here you will find hid compliant mouse you may find different uh, name uh, of driver on your computer. Just right click on it and select update driver. Then after that, it will ask you, how do you want to search for driver? Select search automatically for driver. And the best driver for your device are already installed. So close this and close your device manager and check whether the problem is solved or not. If the problem is still occurring, then the third solution is again updating your mouse driver using a different method. And to do that, click here the search icon and type device manager and open the device manager. Then go here under mice and other pointing option, the arrow, then right click on the driver and select update driver. And we are going to use now browse my computer for driver. And Select here, let me pick from a list of available drivers, select this one. So here you find different uh, drivers for your mouse. So you can select this one or this one and check for that specific driver. So I'm going to select this one and I'm going to click here, click here next. And it will start updating here. Windows has successfully updated your driver and click here close. And you can even try the other one and close this one and close the device manager and check whether the problem is solved or not. Again, if the problem is still occurring, then the first solution for this video will be uninstalling the, device, the mouse driver. So in order to uninstall the mouse driver, which is uninstall and it will reinstall it back. Then click here, the search icon and type device manager. So open here the device manager and you will find here mice and other pointing device, then click here the arrow and again, click on the driver and select here, uninstall device. Then after that, it will give you here HID compliant mouse, warning you are about to uninstall the device from your system. Your system. So select here, uninstall. So when you click here, uninstall, your mouse will stop working. So select restart and it will automatically restart your computer and 
installed the mouse driver again by itself. So after the uninstallation of your mouse driver and restarting your computer, if the problem is still occurring, then the final solution for this video will be performing a system file checking. So in order to do that, you should have to open your CMD. So click here the search icon and type here CMD. Then after you find the command prompt, then right click on it and select run as administrator. Then a confirmation will come, then select here yes. And here the CMD or the command prompt opened. And here I have a command. So here I have a command. So the first command is using the SFC scanner. So just mark this one and copy. Then after you copy it, then paste it here. So after you paste it, then press enter. So it will start the system file check process. So it may take some time. Wait patiently until the checking process would be completed. Here the SFC is kind of completed, which is a system file checking process. Then after that, we are going to copy the second command here, restore hers. So copy this one and paste it again here and press enter. And this one also also take some time. So wait patiently until the restore health or cleanup image process will be completed. So here the restore operation completed successfully. So type here exit and press enter and restart your computer. So this steps can also help you to, to stop the files get deleted automatically. So if this video is helpful, please like, subscribe and share to your friends. Thank you for watching. Chash Tech Review out.